you got to really get get your education and study your arithmetic because it's about money. And if you can't count your money or understand what your money represents and how to use it, then you wind up like me. Well, maybe a little better, but I mean, I didn't never know what I was worth. And most of the music that I wrote, I didn't get paid the kind of money that others were getting for doing the same thing or less. I just didn't know. But if you get education and you understand that it is a business, uh, if you want to be business, now it's an art. In my opinion, music is an art, first of all. As, a, as an art, it's meant to, good, to do good, to make you feel good, to get, in and get to your heart, get to your mind, your soul. That's what art does. Most of you are at a time when you don't think of the art that's in music, or maybe you do, I don't know. I don't know. But the, the society doesn't think of music as an art now. They think of it more as a product. The people that run the businesses think of it as a product. When you look at this product ready, man, we're gonna have this ready. Well, what is a product? It's something that you produce. It's something that you produce. That means, you know, it doesn't come out of necessarily out of your spirit and out of your, your heart. It comes out of what you know. And, you, and, and most people now are aiming at the market. They want, you, you need the market because the marketplace is all about money. The television, you're not going to get on television if you think, if you think ain't selling. You're not going to get on the radio even. <laughs> That's what, before your time, there was a thing called payola. Back in the, in the late 50s and 60s, the, the people who were making records realized that if, 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 if people hear something often enough, they'll think they like it. That's no joke. You know, you, that might have happened to y'all. You, you keep hearing something, even if you don't like it, you find yourself humming it, and you, you don't like it. Man, why am I humming that? You're humming it because you kept hearing it. And so, so the people who were making those things back then, they realized that, man, if we give this disc jockey $50 and say, look, I want you to play this every half an hour, before you know it, in about two or three days, you've been hearing that every half hour you hear that record. And you, you didn't like it, but you, you didn't heard it, you know, every half an hour or something like that. It lasted about, it's still going on, but it's, it's very subtle now. It, you know, it, it does, it's much more sophisticated. <laughs>